going to do a workout from one of the many videos that I saved on YouTube today. I hope you guys can hear me. I'm kind of far away from the camera today, a little further than I normally am. Um, but I'm going to go with one. I have like a whole playlist that I've saved of workouts that I want to do. So we're going to do one today. As you can see, baby is kind of poking herself out there right now. Like, I got these leggings. And I used to be able to come like all the way up to my belly button, but now I'm like a good inch below it in like a week. So she growing pretty big right now. We're gonna try this. We're gonna see. I used to love workouts like this before I was injured. Um, so I'm hoping I'll love it now. And hopefully I don't die. Like fingers crossed. Here we go. I was a do-it-yourself kind of kid, so mom found a school that was tailored for Connections Academy. Going to class online really works well for me. I have a flexible school day and teachers who are there to support me. Which gave me the confidence I needed to follow my dreams. That's a recipe for the future. Online learning may feel new. Hello everyone, I'm Flick Hello. Swan and this is Victoria Ma. We are the creators of Sleep Technique. Welcome to the first in your two prenatal bar workouts. This is a great workout for your lower body and we're going to start by engaging that very important pelvic floor. So let's get going. Six position parallel, so toes and heels together. And then with the tailbone pointing directly down between your heels, bend your knees into demi plie. Now we're going to draw up that pelvic floor, that lower abdominal muscle, the base abdominal, squeeze everything in that, feel your knees press together, feel your glutes and hamstrings engage, good. Now holding that feeling, chasse, slide the foot out, hip distance apart, keep that feeling going. Good, now releasing the tailbone back, lean forward and look down at your knees, check your tracking as we take eight little pulses for eight, seven, six, five, tailbone is back, spine is long, two, one, hold it, now squeeze the pelvic floor again, draw the tailbone under, good, close back into, six position parallel, straighten up, and one more time, find that plie, squeeze, lift everything, press your knees together, feel the inside thighs working, feel the glutes lift so your seat is high even though you're on plie, good, chasse the other leg out, hip distance apart, keep that feet drawing up, look down, send your tailbone back, check your tracking, give the eight pulses for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, knees over toes, hold it, squeeze, now stay on plie, just draw your tailbone under without tucking, long flat spine, tummy button in, good, and then closing back in, squeeze again, extra press together with the knees, Fir firm in your glutes, good, and straighten up, Give you four demi plies in this position. Here we go, ladies, with me. Ready and four, one. And straighten. Two, two more. For three. Last one. Now pulse it down here for eight, seven, six, five. Squeeze your knees together. Now go back into plies down on one. Push up. Two, push up. Three. Good. Ready to pulse? Take it down for eight, seven. Six, five, squeeze four, get ready to release the leg to the side, off the floor, here we go, plie and extend, two, good, three, now little piques, parallel knee to knee, work the outside of the thigh, good, ready to close, six, seven, close on the other side, plie and push, two, and three, and four, little piques, go up, two, three, four, give me three, Two, one, closing in, roll through your feet, Debbie plie, pelvic floor, heels off, rise up, grow taller, keep that lift as you lower, walk back onto your heels, turn out to first position, all in first, four plies, and one, good, two, and three, and pulse it out now, for eight, seven, knees back, feel your glutes activated, plies again, here we go, for four, Push three, knees over toes. Look down and check if you need to. Pulse it out for eight, seven, six, five. Relax your grip on the bar. Ready to extend the leg to the side, plie on one. Extend, 
two, point your foot, lengthen the leg, now little PKs, nice and light, two, three, four, five, six, seven, close on eight, pleading one other side, good, two, work the leg, long leg, little PKs here, for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, closing the first, roll through your feet, draw everything up, long and lengthened, lower with resistance into fourth position, stepping the foot in front, step back a little from your bar if you need to, if you have a chair just move it slightly to the side, maybe you'll have one hand on the bar, one on your hip, let's go plies down, four, one, two heels into the floor, two more, get ready to pulse, little squeezes, two, three, four, equal weight into those legs, 50-50, plie again for one, straighten, plie, up, three, last one, now go down, two, three, getting ready to extend the leg in front of your nose, just off the floor, here we go, plie, one, extend, two, long leg, three, long leg, four, now change the back, four, push, three, and two, and one. Well done, lower the foot, roll through, squeezing those heels off. Now draw up, draw the back foot into first position, switch and change, lower your heels down. Last set, ladies, here we go, plie, one, push, two, and three, and four. Pulse it out for one, two, three, And again, plie for one, push, two, keep those heels down, knees back, tummy in, and one, two, three, four, good, one, two, ready, lift the leg off front for one, push, two, push, three, last one coming up, transfer now, back leg off, squeeze your glute, pushing up, last two, Last one, well done, low and roll through your feet. Heels come off, just take a moment. Come back into first position. Adjust if you need to, if you move from your bar. Well done, lower your heels down. Squeeze, ready to extend the leg out to the side. It's tondu one, lower your heel, now press back to tondu and squeeze into first. We're only going to work first. Position, again, out, lower, so no fifths yet. Especially if you're in your later stages of pregnancy, sometimes fifth can be uncomfortable. Let's add an arm up to fifth, low and follow. So listening to your body all the time, ladies. Listen to your body and your bump. Two more, good. Press back. Last one. Well done. Let's hand on the bar now. Let's add a plie. Out, plie in second now. Good. Knees back, long spine. Press. Two more like this. Press. Good. Enjoy this plie to open the hips. Add your arm up to fifth now. One, follow it. Good. Pull back. Again, two, follow. Press. Again, out to big pour de bras. Using the breath. Last one. Let's take one extra, lowering the hands onto the bar. And then let's lift the heels up. Rises up for eight. Lower. Seven. Squeeze your glutes. Pull up your kneecaps like you're wearing a very, very tight pair of jeans. Something that most of us at this point would not want to do. Can you do eight more with a balance in fifth? See if you can. Take your time. Two. Sometimes that balance feels a little different now that there's a little bit of extra weight in the front. Four more. So if you need to put your hands on the bar, please do. Last two. Well done. Last one. Lower your heels, lower your hands, drop to one side, squish that heel around, parallel. Hand on the hip, bend your front leg, stretch out the back calf. And then taking the arm forward, breathe. Looking past, gentle twist up the back only. Again, looking past the things, this time up. And then hands off the bar to interlace. Bend your front leg, stretch out your back. Lengthen up from your waist, three, two, one, hands onto the bar, stretch your foot, close into first, let's go from the top on the other side, with me, ready, out on one, straight leg lower, push back, close into first, again, out, 
lower, close into first. Try and squeeze those inside thighs. It's great for your adductor muscles. Really good for our strong legs. Now arm off four, lower, good again, two, lower, press up. Keeping those knees pulled up, there's no plie yet. Last one, come back on the bar, add your plie now. For one, deeper this time, enjoy the second position, good. Knees back over toes, press, last one, can we add the port de bras? Arm to fifth, four, one, follow it. Press, and don't collapse the back. As you pull your bra, keep your shoulders open, chest wide. Two more, breathe. Last one, and then a little extra one. Lowering to second, hands onto the bar. Let's rise for eight, and lower. Try as you lower, to really resist the heels going down, so you're not clunking or thumping. on that soft landing, no jarring. Good, two more, seven. Again, have another go, see if you can. Can you take one hand off, then the other? Yes, good, excellent. Well done, everyone, lift those heels, lift and lower. Four more, and three. Can you lengthen your elbows a little more? Last one, hold, lower your heels, switch that heel around. Well done, bend your front leg. Let's go, sweep and look back. Again, sweep. Pressing your back heel this time, sweep, interlace those hands, bend your front knee a little bit more, stretch out the back leg, beautiful, good. Let's release, come back to face me and hold that leg in second, little back more fondues, touch the toes to the front of the ankle, make a diamond shape, one, and extend, now touch the back, two, not too high, coordinating the leg. Pause. Time out. Fat girl gotta breathe. Y'all ain't done this type of stuff in like two years. Probably more than that. Like if you don't keep with it, you lose it. Like big time. like four minutes left. I can do this. I can do this. Legs. Good. Now this time we're going to take that foot to the back and extend it to the back to squeeze into the glute and hamstring. Not too high. Two more. Now we can work for a little bit more height as we lower the toes to the floor. One. Lift a little higher. You can tilt your body forward over your bar or chair, but check your shoulders are square. You're not twisting. I want two more here, five, last one, six, hold it here, and then releasing it if you can, the other arm off, opposite to your back leg, hold, beautiful, now, as we did in our warm up, bring your tailbone under, lift your pelvic floor, find the tiro passe derriere, beautiful, cross the leg over, well done ladies, we're going into a stretch, lengthen, let's stretch out the quadricep as well, so come back up, Drop your supporting heel to parallel. You need to leave one hand off the bar and lengthen. Breathe. We do all of this on the other side. So first position and extend the leg out to second. Ready to touch the toes in the front to the knee. Fondue one. Extend. Two. And three. And four. Now go to the back, right behind the back of your head. Three more. Two, knees back. Now touch the floor, one, lift up a little higher. So again, if you're tilting more towards the bar, check your shoulders are even. Good, two more now for five, lift, six. Let's try and find that balance, other arm comes off. So the opposition arm, opposite leg, stretch. Now pelvic floor, drop the tailbone, lift. Tummy in, bump high. Beautiful, cross the leg over. Ready for our side stretch, up and over. Sit a little into that hip, stretch out the side of the body. Good. Back to centre. 
drop that heel back, knee to knee, take hold of your foot, lengthen out the quad, feels nice. You've got a final exercise to do, working a little bit more into flexibility and opening up the hips. Always a good thing in your pregnancy. First position, we're going to take four back on glisse, the last one closing to fourth position on demi point, just putting the foot behind us, and two back one on cross in attitude. Follow along with us. Ready? Six, seven, back one glisse goes one, two, three, pace it behind four. Now swing and release, close into first position, change legs. Four, one, two, pop the foot behind and sink, lift up. Press, close into first, add your arm to fifth, one, two, three, put it behind you, now swing and down, close into first, changing, four, one, two, three, pop it behind you, lift and lower, close into first, final time, roll through your feet, heels come off, fifth position, take your balance, tummy and ribs drawn together, holding that lovely lifted length and body, all the way around, Ooh, lowering your heels, you might want to take a moment just to have a little bit of check everything's going in the right place, and then hands onto the bar, step to the side, foot behind, robots, well done ladies, see you again soon. Y'all we made it, we made it, you guys. You guys, we made it. Tell people that Liberty Mutual customizes car insurance, so you only pay for what you need. Yeah, we made it. We made it. So, with most of my workouts now, I'm trying to add a little bit of arms to all of them. So, I decided today. Since I just did that video, and there weren't a whole lot of arms other than the occasional like lift the arms, which you know I had issues with because coordination. But I decided to throw in some ones that I used to do back in college that were some of my favorites from body sculpting. So I'm gonna do those and try not to die. Sounds like a really good plan to me. Because they thought it would be an easy class because it's called 
body sculpting and they're like well I'm an athlete I'm already in great condition and we would get these like real buff football players they would come in there and they'd be doing those exercises they would be like dying falling out on the floor by the end of the class and all us girls are in there like we got this we weren't stupid so special guest over here He's been outside doing his little workout too. He's been working on the outside of the house and getting some stuff done in the yard. Um, I might show you guys what he's done because he's worked really hard today. I put in a new faucet in my bathroom. I'm really excited about that because my old one has been broken for a while. Okay, hey, thank you, Micah Benham. Yes, thank you to my brother-in-law, Micah. Big shout out huge shout out he's always helpful but yes he provided that faucet for us and we're like super thankful he provided a runner he provided a runner that he just installed for the dogs um they haven't seen it yet so they're going to be real excited because we can't leave them outside by themselves because we don't have a fenced in yard so they'll be really excited to be able to run around off the leash they'll still be tied but they're not on the leash so they have more room so, all right. Thanks for watching. Stop. Take Stop. a step outside in a minute and show you guys his handiwork. Uh, but if I can do the workouts, you can do the workouts. Let's get healthy. Ish. Have a good day, guys. See you next time. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share, do whatever. Thanks. So this is the handiwork that my lovely husband has been working on put up a runner for these babies phoenix is on it pass off scooby here no, no, no.